Hey breezers, how are you guys? Foodie Beauty is still live on Let's Bees. I'm gonna check it out for a few minutes because frankly, I'm just nosy. So <laughs> I figure let's go ahead and watch together. Hello? It's almost as if like seeing the video of the th actual stuff happening. Oh. I get like flashbacks of it, like seeing it. Right. And then so maybe it like re-traumatized. I don't know what happened, but it's like I get flashbacks of it, like see it over and over. And then I you. see flashbacks of like his face being like, like the way he taunted her after, like he fucking did that to me. And then that I keep getting flashbacks of then when that happened to me. So it's like I just I have a lot of like internal stuff I'm trying to just get out of my mind right now because like, uh -huh. you know. It'd be really helpful if you had a professional to talk to. Well, I hope it's not. You know, I hope. I don't know. Tiffany! This man hates himself. He's full of hate and self-loathing and just evil. And whenever they're not online, he's probably like, I don't know. I just can't picture. I can't imagine. And I just don't want to. And it's just... It must so, be awful. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Tiffany, hi! It's amazing how she can go from talking about like heavy things to like you know talking like this. Ah! You think so? It's amazing to me. Children videos. She lied. Yeah. She's at the stage it, when you're at the stage where you love them no matter what. You don't. You can't. Like you. It won't happen. So. <laughs> and it didn't happen for, like it's true like it didn't happen for me and you know we should talk about What's some things Bowser? other than Nader I'm sorry yeah thanks Bowser you do think less than I, I'm doing a lot actually like my mind is like when I think of pre-hotel like I, even just like that month ago or whatever uh -huh. it's completely different mindset completely different mindset so Maybe. I think any residual feelings I have from it is trauma processing there's no emotions towards him whatsoever other uh -huh. than you know what I mean? Like, I see the situation from a more logical standpoint, and I'm fucking thankful for that. I don't... I just don't... You ever just... Just disbelief at how you came to be where you are? Like... Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, is this my life? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> but it doesn't husband. have to be your life anymore. Like, if you go and get help or go talk to a professional and start working on yourself, you can have the most beautiful life beyond your wildest dreams you just gotta go talk to somebody i'm sorry you went through that it's certainly not that's horrible no people like pe men like this people abu abusive people like that need to be locked away forever mm -hmm. like you're just a, you're gonna hurt people with your life no that's not purpose no yeah, it's something you can beat. It's hard as hell, but... And it leaves you scarred. It leaves you messed up. Like, in ways... You act emotionally in ways you just never imagined that you would feel, you know? So. I'm not going to get my hopes up. But it kind of sounds like... I don't know. Like, her eyes are open more now, I guess. Maybe she wants better for herself. Maybe she is... Maybe she wants to change. Maybe this is a beginning for her. Like I said, I'm not going to get my hopes up because every time I do, my little feelings get let down. So I just, things sound different today. Um, to me, anyways. Yeah. So now, see, now when I think, start thinking about, okay, tomorrow I'm going to go get a nice espresso machine mm -hmm. and set up my place, my breakfast nook, and I'm going to see that guy... Uh-oh. So. Why do you need to see that guy, though? Why don't you just spend a day doing things for your house and making it, I don't know, more like a home? Who cares I call about the guy? Existence. 
self-diagnosed you? That doesn't sound right. Kate Bush. That's what the song, her song is about her, like, abusive relationship, eh? I'm okay. You know, hanging in. What about you? I'm doing good, thank you. I'll pray for her. We all should. Yeah. She doesn't seem like herself at all. Mm -mm. You start losing yourself when you're in that situation. Because you take on all that toxic energy. You take on their bullshit. They put everything on you. So they're looking to you for a solution to their problems that they keep fucking exacerbating. And I couldn't do that anymore. Like, I felt insane. Like, no. I did... The wax appointment is supposed to be next week, but I'm, I'm not sure. I'm gonna... I'll probably go. Yes, I'm gonna make my space better. Absolutely. You should. Habizer? I'm still talking to Habizer. He, he messaged me, sent me little rose emojis and said, there's nothing wrong. Just you're being... You're too sensitive. LOL. Mm. So, you know what? He's right. I think I'm just gonna go with the flow and let things fall in place. Okay. All I can do is just worry about what I can control. No? That's exactly right. Do things I've done in my apartment. Nice. I want... I know. I love doing that. You can't wax? Why? Would it hurt too bad? Hi, Vicky! Sometimes us cleansing our space helps us rid of negative energy. Absolutely. It's I'm going to book those boxes things. Oh, I was going to ask Roman. He was going to take them out. Do you guys think I should book Roman to come and do it? You might give me Why a discount. Why are you getting involved with Roman again? Does My that, that stuff driving go, around please. Holding him down. Oh, no! What did you order? Don't tell me you just ordered a snack wrap. Because that snack wrap is going to be fucking disintegrated by the time it gets to your door. Mm. Like yesterday, was it yesterday I had Taco Bell? We went to the drive-thru uh -huh. and uh, the guy, like, I don't know, I saw a little bag. I ordered the Crunchwrap Supreme Meal. Why? What's wrong with the Brazilian? Ouchie? Oh, no. I don't want them. I don't want to bend over. If, like, anyway. <laughs> anyway. Um. Someone sent a super chat asking, does this make you miss the stability you had with BB? Okay, let's go to real time to see if she answers that. Miss the stability you had with BB? No, I don't miss. I don't. I don't. When I think of the relationship with BB, I don't want a relation. I don't think I want a relationship like that anymore. Mm -hmm. I want to have relationships with people. I don't want to have a monogamous, tied down. I don't want to be tied down. I feel tied down. I want to fucking cut the strings and fly. You know, mm -hmm. I don't want to anything to tie me down at all. I want to travel. I want to be free. Okay. Just me. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right. Solo on that note. All right, you guys. I will check back in with her in a little bit. I hope you guys are having a great day, a great evening, wherever you are. And I will see you so soon. Bye.